thing is my fellow warriors by the camel and today um, I'd like to urge you guys not to make fun of the new gym goers and the whole point of the video is because I've noticed over and over again that uh, at the beginning of the year the habitual gym goers all already start um, you know gossiping about the fact that the gym is going to be crowded Duh, it's going to be crowded. That's normal. And it should be commendable for people to try to better themselves, right? So you should help them in the whole process. Not that it's any of your concern to, uh, to, help, to help somebody that you don't know. But the least you can do is try to abstain from uh, spewing some nonsense uh, in terms of uh, as in oh the gym is going to be crowded and look at those people they're gonna drop out soon and this and that don't be so negative and of course we know that chances are most of them will drop off like ants flies whatever you want to to, to name it but at least have give them a chance to try it uh, give them a shot and if it doesn't work out, then hey, it just didn't work out. But you can't just expect people not to do anything about it, you know, about whatever, uh, uh, what you call them, uh, fitness goals that they always wish to, 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 uh, to reach. You can't just have them not do anything about it. You know, they have to do something about it. If they pick the new year um, to uh, jump things up, then so be it. If you want the habitual one that used to the gym and uh, you feared uh, the idea of the gym being full, there's so many ways to get fit. So you don't have to hang around uh, waiting for the machine or waiting for the equipment. If by then you still don't know how to get fit uh, with the minimal amount of equipment, then you've been wasting your time. That's the reality and the sad truth about it. So. Uh, beside the fact that you want to sound fancy or be, uh, I mean, feel special about you being the gym goer and uh, uh, trying to dissociate, I mean, dissociate yourself from uh, uh, somebody else who, you know, may not, may not be at your, at your level, it's just mm, something that I can't really relate to. It just doesn't make any sense. And to play the, maybe the devil advocate, I would just say that uh, people say, I mean, people uh, come about those, uh, this type of argument for the sake of uh, entertainment. Because beside that, if it's really something that uh, bothers you that much, well, I feel sorry for you. And uh, yeah, you just, it don't make any sense at all. So please don't be one of those people who, uh, feel bothered by the new gym goers and um, if you worry about the fact that the gym is going to be full and the equipment won't be available there are many ways to go about training if you don't know one of those many ways feel free to look through my channel you find ways to get fit uh, with the minimal amount of uh, equipment and if you, f you look through and you still can't find anything well feel free to hire me as a coach or if you like it to be around i mean hire me as a personal trainer uh not that time uh there's enough time available for everybody in the world but the least i can do is uh, pay attention to your concern and uh, make your goal dream uh, your dream go uh the goal you ever dream of uh, become reality so that was um something that i felt i should make a video about and uh, yeah don't be one of those people who are worried about no gym goers uh, they already have a lot to worry about for you to add another uh, useless uh uh what you call uh, stress that it can uh, impede the ability to get accustomed to the new environment that being said um everything is and we always be uh i would say in the camera way but let me reiterate again please don't be part of this senseless dynamic going on between new gym goers and you know habitual goers in the camera way salute